Okay, we have the machine on, we have the motors engaged. So it now doesn't move, if the motors disengage, the whole thing will slide quite easily along the, along the tracks. Okay, first we do is we get a, we have to get a part cut. So this is um, the library. Go into the library and then use the, the arrow keys to go to the one we want to look at. We'll have the rectangle one there, enter, standard enter. It brings it up in the sizes. So we'll say, okay, we want to cut it uh, 200 by function down, 200 by 50. We'll leave those as the same. Top entry, then it's got an entry and a drop. All those are things we'll, we'll learn about. We want to apply. Okay. That's what she's turned out with. This is going, showing down here as it's showing it's an ex it cutting it externally. We want an internal cut. It then shows the lead in, lead out there on the internal. External cut. We want to apply that. Okay, apply. Escape. Okay, we've chosen our part from the library and we've basically loaded into memory. We then can go automatic to down there. Can't see it. So in automatic we're able to view the part. There's the part. Now we've loaded the part in there so we can see it. Now we go escape. Now if we want to run the program, because there's no torch or anything on like this, we're just looking at how how it runs, we can push the X button. And then these two buttons here are the run program and stop the program. So run program, it will then try and run the program. Let's hope it doesn't crash into the camera. It's running the program there and out here we've got the machine working the same as what we've got there. Running into the camera. <laughs> Okay, so it works. Okay, we're going to go into the library again. And we're going to try the test line setup. And we'll make it 200. Apply, apply, escape, and we're going to go into automatic again, so we can load it and see it, view the program. Okay, we're going to go to manual because we don't want to burn it because we haven't got any um, torch or anything set up as yet. Manual. And then put on the test, X. And we're going to try and see what this will do in cutting it. So what I've done, I will hit go in a minute. I'm going to move the camera over and we're going to see what it does. I've just taped a, um, a, a marking pin on the end. Okay, we'll move it across. <laughs> 